<laughs> Connect this wire here and silence. God damn it. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Uh, uh okay. <laughs> Hot wiring doesn't work as well as you remember it working. <laughs> oh, Nation, okay, the right. Room, the rug has been tossed aside. And I believe the trapdoor was probably closed behind them. By the way, I'm tapping the amulet effect on the unconscious person on my way past. That they're in a trunk. Wait, they were put out in a trunk? Yes. Yes. Okay. Sorry. They I were tied up with the uh, clothes and put it in a trunk. Oh, in that case I don't even well, I guess I do know they're there, but it's not worth my time. Yeah. Yeah, I'm probably just heading down. Eighteen. Oh. The place where the people went down appears to be tile floor. Well, I was keeping track of their location, so... Yes, the place where they appeared to go down is tile floor. I mean, that that's fine. Clearly there's something under the tile. Yeah, us. Awesome, what's your plan for this? I just... Look Please for just cracks throw the rug over high. and go... They bamboozled us. They're not here. Oh! Uh Please? Because that'd be fucking great. Actually, given the fact that you heard mental communication, I, well, I'm rolling a luck die to see if I even think of that. It's above a 10. You know, yeah. sure. <laughs> I just, I have my pistol out and I'm injured, but I roll the rug back over. And appear to be searching the room. But I, I even call uh, call out o uh, over over the radio. I infiltrate through the back door, and there's no one here. Uh, you hear a whimper from the counter. Oh, oh, I'm I'm in character. I I um I mean, if I'm acting in character, I have to respond to that. Yeah. I go over to the whimper. It, it's just a cowering, uh, weedy teenager. Oh, they missed someone. We didn't oh, oh right, they just they just put him down. Did the teenager is this in the break room? No, he's behind the counter, like I said, which oh, is yeah. all like uh, ten steps from the break room. If that, what if he seen them inside it? Possibly. He's not really looking at the break room at the moment, but given what I, these guys look like, possibly. I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to try and, you know, amulet him. <laughs> the thing is, could he have seen the trapdoor from uh, his position? No. But he might have seen you investigating, and you do strike a rather imposing figure. Yeah, so I, I'm going to amulet him. And honestly, I'm going to take this and rub it all over you. <laughs> um, roll to hit. Okay, he's cowering. <laughs> That's true. And a police Let's officer. It's gonna be pretty easy. I. That's a fourteen on the die. You hit. Yeah. And honestly, is this guy going to succeed? Ever, unless he gets a ton of nat 20s. I mean, it's not my point, uh, purpose to roll for him. So. Um, as your average, everyday weedy teenager, a nat 20 is not a success. Oh, right. <laughs> so, in short, uh, no. It does take two turns, though. Uh, during that time... Like, as soon as I think I'm about to get the door open, I summon all of my uh, skeletons to the room we're in. Like, some of them right. are just pointing up the stairs to make sure that nobody follows us, and some of them are just arrayed at the door to make sure that anybody, any welcoming party on the other side has a very bad day. Oh god, the police outside just saw the skeletons vanish. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> like, literally, um... the skeletons duck into cover and just never come back out. 
The, uh... Because it has uh, subtle one on it. Yeah. Well, that just means it's a DC 20 perception check. Um... So, by the way, I, I am going to mentally comment to them that, um... Uh, for now, I'll cover your tracks. Thank you kindly. Uh, who are you? Um. Uh, shit. Uh, Todd, how did Amula introduce itself again originally? I didn't, I believe. Oh. <laughs> just another. Uh, 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 just responds with. I've never been in this situation before. Uh, so, uh, someone who's uh, 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 someone who owes one of the two people down there a favor. Eh, good enough for me. Right. Um. So, by the way, what I'm going to do first of all, uh, mentally check the teenager. Does he know anything about where they went? You realize to do that, you have to rub the amulet on him again. I, I'm still putting a hand on his shoulder with the amulet palmed. Okay, does he know? No. He heard some noises and cowered harder. <laughs> he did the correct thing. Okay. Well, I'm gonna properly pocket it again and do, you know, standard police action things of, uh, you know, escorting him out and reporting that I didn't find anything. That they're just gone. I went in through the back door. Strictly speaking, roll deception. Practically speaking, I know how that's going to end. <laughs> yeah, with me guiding his actions? <laughs> yeah, it's like, okay, you have that rank, and then you have plus, oh god, for <laughs> circumstance. <laughs> yeah, I, I rolled a 10 on the die. <laughs> Oh man, do you think these guys can pass a DC forty check? <laughs> Thought it was only thirty anyway. Circumstance. Oh, circumstance, right? The circumstance of wearing their friend's entire fucking body <laughs> and correctly using his personality is extreme. <laughs> yep. Grats, guys, I am magically managing to cover the hell out of your tracks. Damn it, Sean, your face again! <laughs> Only as a secondary, and I'm one hell of a special face. Oh man, I'd have loved being the face, but he's currently locked up. <laughs> we'll How go back is to that me. a face? Oh wait, no, you're right, that is His a face. Charisma is five. <laughs> <laughs> you're not that high, but okay. Well, it's at very high in terms of technicality. It's just not supernatural. Around about at this time, the door opens. Uh, is there suddenly a spray of bullets going in two directions, or...? Um, no. There are four very spooked-looking technicians with their hands up. Technicians, huh? Well, they're wearing lab coats. I call out, right, is this a secret laboratory or a prison? Yes. It's both? Y yeah. Uh, I'll take you to the prison, please don't shoot me. Oh, no. You have my guarantee that you will not get shot as long as you do not try to fuck us over. Should from another one. Should should I just lock myself in the closet or something? I don't. Well, <laughs> if you think it would help, I mean, we could just keep you all uh, gathered up, you know, in the break room or some thing, you know. Have, I you, wouldn't you... recommend keeping them in the break room. Just have them locked down here. Have one of your oh no no break room started. down here. They don't. They have a break room down here. They don't use that one. Fair. Now, if anybody tries to do some heroics, well, let's just say that let's leave the heroics to the heroes, right? There's no need to be afraid of us, 
unless you're trying to do something stupid. Alright? Oh, okay. Should I be rolling persuasion for that? Honestly? Nation works as well, but, uh... They're very not into the concept of fighting you. Oh, this is mostly to calm them down. Okay. A panicking person makes a lot of mistakes. I'd rather <laughs> not mistakes happen. Yeah, go ahead and roll persuasion. Alright. Only one roll. Uh, 21. Yeah, that works just fine for all of them. They're all significantly more relaxed. Yep, they're escorted into the break room, and one of the skeleton pulls out a deck of cards and sa and asks, "So here, who here's played Klashnikov?" <laughs> and the scene shifts away from that awkward moment, <laughs> especially since two of them uh, are familiar with the word. Best Russian card game. So, did you send them all in there, or did you keep one to lead oh, you to the place? Oh, we're keeping one to, as a guide. The guy who uh, uh, offered to guide us is guiding us around. Okay. He's playing tour guide. To the point of, Don Carbone asks, "So, what exactly is the point of this facility?" Um. Experimental containment and experiments. Mm. And you have About two prisoners you currently? Uh, we have twelve. Twelve? As I understand, some of them have been here for a decade. Oh. Hmm. You know, if I design a secondary character, this is a good excuse to put them into existence. Oh, yeah. If all of my characters weren't members of the Undead Mafia, this would be a great time to introduce a few. If I could actually use one of my characters. You're, are you still on about that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he stops you at a door and says, uh, through here, automated defenses that will probably have been turned on, and I can't turn them off from this side. Oh, uh... Can you get through to the other side to turn them off without help, or...? I wouldn't... expect so. Mm. He points at a camera just in the corner. Mm -hmm. Do you have audio systems set up? Yes. Where's the intercom? When you say audio systems, uh, the cameras have microphones. Do you have a speaker system set up? Yeah. PA. It's called There's a PA. Walks up to the camera. You know why we're here, don't you? You'd probably be rather stupid if you didn't. Yes, we know. No, you're not getting in. <clears throat> Are you sure about that? I'm... Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're wrong about that one. See, uh... Well... Let's call it a blessing of being undead. I've got time to spare. You don't. You'd be amazed. Mm. Artificial intelligence or just real confident? We have a pantry. All right. Hey, Reaper. How fast mm -hmm. can you get to the other side of that corridor? Very. Think you could take one of my boys with you? Uh, yeah, probably. Let's see if you can outrun those bullets, huh? Yeah, sure. Actually, it is uh, like turrets and shit that the uh, automated defenses are, right? And at least one mashy spike plate. Ooh, a classic! I thought we were the villains here. Uh, 
Oh, this probably plays my... I might. think they put it in because there's a lot of people that don't do bullets. On which note, I've never been told about it, but that probably means there's going to be, like, flamethrowers and shit as well. They could do better than that. I mean, come on. Why not a Tesla gate? Thing is, with te- What? Hold on. Yeah, he did go missing around here. And now to introduce a uh, secondary character I'm planning on building. You got a prisoner here who's uh, a little more prisonery. Lightning powers. Kind of a ghost. If we do, I don't work with him. Ah. Uh. I hope Electrode's here. Well, uh, pop open the door and stand to the side. Well? Pop open the door and set him aside. Yeah, and stand to the side. Open the door so the oh. door can and dash through with uh, one of my boys and get, get to the other side. <laughs> you pop open the door, shotgun pellets hit the other wall. Yeah, that's about right. <laughs> well, that's about right. Ooh, ooh, I've always wanted to try this. Pulls out the pen knife and just tosses it across the line, across the doorway. Does it get shot? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wanted to do that. It's Oh, man. Not enough people respect the classics these days. So, so what's my progress looking like? What progress? I think he's dashing in and through. Yes. At maximum velocity. Uh, it's looking painful. Mm, how painful is painful? Three rolls. Oh, boy. Ugh. I think he can dodge, though. Can he? Yes, but that's, um, despite it being called an active defense, that's not something he rolls for. Mm. So what am I rolling, then? Uh, you're rolling damage resist. Oh, shit, okay, the does first that one... mean my, uh, my skeleton also has to roll that? Um, yes, but only two of them. So the first one's a 20, not Nat. <laughs> first one's an 18. And second one's a 13. Okay, that one was a 20, Nat. That's for 26. <laughs> oh, boy. The third one is phenomenal. That's 12. Okay, so Gage, you take a minus one. <gasps> oh no. The skeleton takes a minus one and is stunned. Ah, shit. The skeletons don't have regeneration. The skeleton stunned. does. I'm mean, not stunned. It's dazed, but yeah. It's dazed. It's not like that's super. Super important. Right. So, I turn to the scientist. Walk me through so I can walk him through how to turn off the security systems. Uh... The, the problem is... They're all controlled from the central area, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. Calls out. Could you come pick me up? I guess I'm flying back and picking him up. That was painful. I can imagine. He probably gets positives because he's running away from the... I... Uh, Gage? Yes. Are you sure you want to run back through that twice? 
instead of just pressing forward and finding the control room. I guess I'll just go ahead and press forward for now. Guess not. Well, you've got a skeleton with you. Yeah, you can just tell him how to hack. <laughs> Not only that, but my character's uh, pretty good with technology, too. Really? Yes. In fact, he's so good that he ended up having to teach the entire office how to use Windows Server. <laughs> What's your bonus to technology? Nine. Five? Nine. Nine? Nine. Oh. Get with the times. Old man. <laughs> so, uh, for all that uh, this is a defensive passage, it appears to have more des been designed to keep people from escaping. Oh. Because the security door to allow you to be shot opened up relatively easily, actually. There's no security door at the other side. <clears throat> Not a real proper one. Hmm. So you're able to just cross the hallway into a relatively safe zone. You hope. Nice. Okay, so I guess I'm looking for some sort of control switches. I assume you're just going to start speed running through the area. Pretty much. Uh, with how much caution? I mean, a fair amount. There's already been proven to be traps. Okay. It'll probably take a little bit longer then, but uh, go ahead and roll something relevant. Probably investigate. Twenty-four. As you're moving through the base... You spot a very panicked looking guy sitting at a very large bank of computers. But as you run up to uh, as you run up to him, something catches your eye. There's a glowing bit in the door frame between you and him. I pause and look at it. What does it look like? Uh something technology and probably an emitter. An emitter, huh? A gun barrel is poked into it. <laughs> the carried skeleton is just like, yeah, I'll shoot this. <laughs> no, he's uh, not you poke it. It. He's just poking it's got a glass the... cover. So it goes... Uh, you, you poke it. It's got a glass cover. It goes ting. Hmm. It's a very complicated situation you find yourself in. Stand back, boss. I'll open it up for us. Alright, sure. Smashes it with the butt of his gun. As much as I want to say roll to hit, you don't have to roll to hit on this. You smash it with the butt of your gun. And there's just kind of a crackling pop as the entire doorway flashes white. And the guy at the console gets up and runs. I catch him. <laughs> so, we're not getting in, huh? Say again? So, uh, we're not getting in, huh? Uh, my skeleton in kind of waltzes in menacingly. I think you'll best let the boss through that little corridor of traps of yours. Wouldn't want anything unfortunate to happen to you, now would we? Yeah, yeah. Then don't do it over uh, the PA. 
Don't let them in. It won't end well for any of us. Look, the boss is an honorable fella. You'll all get to live. Hell, you'll all get to go free and everything. We're just going uh, roll... to... Persuasion. Roll persuasion on that. Oh, for for the uh, skeleton? Yeah. I... 13. Well, that's Phenomenal. a damn thing better than four. Yeah, you know, look, you can either help us with this, or I can just do this myself and kill you now. Your choice. Rolling my persuasion. Sits down and starts typing. That's, that's, a, a, that's a 22. Yeah. <laughs> he definitely sits down and Wanna starts typing. Want to know something typing. hilarious? Over the shouting of the PA. I rolled an 18 to that. <laughs> He is minus five to persuasion. A skeleton's good day. Yeah, they're not very much the persuading types. They're very much the I'll beat you until you tell me what I want to know types. Which is why they have ten ranks of in, in intimidation. Uh, Sean, some intimidating looking folks with uh, higher tech armor than usual, let's say show up insisting that a secret prison is being broken into at this moment. Oh boy. I mean... I blink at them and say... Where? Just let us get to it. As they push past you. Um, Are they flashing badges? That's what I was thinking. Actually, yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> um, yes, mental... yes, they are. Yes, they are. Okay. Oh. I j oh, God, are they even with? <laughs> are they within a hundred feet of me at this point? Or absolutely, they're pushing past you. No, I mean, or do you mean the people downstairs? Yeah. No, no, yes, Sean. Sure. That, that, that's where you go. Oh, since you're going into some secret prison, I found this on the ground in the break room. Um, right now I'm actually being a bit overcautious just because, um, okay, how high tech is this armor? You say a bit, but. Just a bit. It's not quite covered in glowing neon lights, but. Yeah, it's, it's definitely got some, um, what you pr doubt is actually ceramic plates. Hmm. I'm a little afraid that these sorts of people are going to be resistant to mental effects, but... Um, well, if you have connection to us... Yeah, if I have connection, I'm warning you that uh, some much bigger shots are apparently... Site rules and regulations. You need to check their IDs. They already gave them. You need to check that they're real. Any schmuck can show up in flat... Ash a fake badge. Hell, I've done it a few times. True. Uh, just um, <laughs> uh, for now, I'm going to defer to the personality of the person I'm controlling. He brings up his radio, calls it in. It takes about half a second to get a responsive. Yes, they're supposed to be there. Let them in. <laughs> okay. 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 Well, as soon as the traps are turned off, we rush through the hallways, bringing our resident tour guide with us. <laughs> you have a also, shiny new tour guide. Also, how many of these people? Shiny guys? How many of what people? The newbies. Or, uh, not really uh, newbies, but the ones with who are clearly... Dozen of them. Dozen, huh? It's concerning. Hold on a moment. Depending on how far that holding cell's immunity radius is, it may all turn irrelevant as soon as you save my main. 